हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल इन दिस वीडियो वी डिस्कस व्हाट लेंथ ऑफ टैपोलिन थ्री मीटर वाइड विल बी रिक्वायर्ड टू मेक कॉनिकल टेंट ऑफ हाइट एट मीटर एंड बेस रेडियस सिक्स मीटर सो इन दिस क्वेश्चन वी फाइंड द लेंथ ऑफ टैपोलिन इफ दिस इज द लेंथ ऑफ टैपोलिन इज एल दैट इज थ्री मीटर वाइड इज यूज टू मेक अ कॉनिकल टेंट दिस टैपोलिन इज यूज टू मेक कॉनिकल टेंट ऑफ हाइट एट मीटर एंड बेस रेडियस सिक्स मीटर अज्यूम दैट एक्स्ट्रा लेंथ ऑफ द मटीरियल दैट विल बी रिक्वायर्ड फॉर स्टिचिंग मार्जिन एंड वेस्टेज इन कटिंग इज अप्रॉक्सीमेटली ट्वेंटी सेंटीमीटर एंड दिस ट्वेंटी सेंटीमीटर लेंथ दैट इज यूज फॉर स्टिचिंग मार्जिन एंड द वेस्टेज ऑफ कटिंग सो गिवन इज द रेडियस ऑफ बेस ऑफ टेंट it is r equal to 6 meter and height of tent height of tent equal to 8 meter first we find the slant height of the tent height and radius is given we find slant height so slant height that we find so cone is a right circular based cone so we use Pythagoras theorem to find slant height it is l square equal to h square plus r square h is the height it is 8 meter square plus r square r is radius it is 6 meter square so l is equal to square root 8 meter square 8 meter is 64 meter square plus 6 meter square it is 36 meter square So L is equal to sixty four plus thirty six. It is equal to hundred meter square, and L is equal to ten meter. So slant height of the tent is equal to ten meter. Now we find curved surface area of the tent. Curved surface area of tent. It is equal to pi r l. Pi r l. So we find curved surface area because this tapolin is used to make the tent. So we need to find its curved surface area. So it is equal to pi. Its value is twenty two over seven. R is radius. Radius is six meter. Into L, L is slant height. It is ten meter. So in this twenty two multiply by six multiply by ten, we get answer one thousand three hundred twenty over seven meter square. This is the curved surface area of tent. now we find the length of the tapolin used to make tent so area of tapolin equal to curved surface area of tent area of tapolin equal to curved surface area of tent area of tapolin tapolin is in the form of rectangle so it is length multiply by breadth and curved surface area of tent that we find 1320 meter square over 7 length we find and breadth is given it is 3 meter equal to 1320 meter square over 7 and l is equal to 1320 over 7 and 3 transposing to right hand side so it divide so l is equal to One thousand three hundred twenty divided by twenty-one. On divide it by twenty-one, we get answer sixty-two point eight meter. So length of tapolin equal to sixty-two point eight meter. So length of tapolin equal to sixty-two point eight meter. Now we find the total length of tapolin. Total length it is equal to length of tapolin. Sixty-two point eight meter plus twenty centimeter. This is the stitching margin and used in wastes. So sixty-two point eight meter plus twenty centimeter. This is the total length of the tapolin, and it is equal to sixty-two point eight meter plus twenty over hundred meter. So we change the unit centimeter to meter. So it is equal to sixty-two point eight meter plus zero point two zero meter. and it is equal to 63.0 meter and it is equal to 63 meter so length of the tapolin equal to 63 meter 
थैंक्स फॉर वॉचिंग लाइक कमेंट एंड शेयर माई वीडियो सब्सक्राइब माई यूट्यूब चैनल